What up internet? TV Geek here with a recap of the How I Met Your Mother episode, Hopeless. After last week's episode, I was really wanting this to be awesome. And I'll tell you, the cold open did not get off to a good start at all. So it starts with a flashback of Barney with his dad. Your buzzkill little ma thinks I'm a, a bad influence on you. Barney goes, That's, what is that word you taught me? Bull something? <laughs> Lame. Super lame. And then when he says, it's gonna be... Lead and Jerry. That's terrible. Those are like painful. Ugh. You know what, to be honest, I kinda hate kids on sitcoms. Not like George Michael, I mean like a proper kid. And not one that's a lead, not like Kevin Arnold. He doesn't count. There are two that come to mind that are just the worst. Jack's kid on Will and Grace. I'm not your father. But you are. My mom still has your file. Terrible actor. Uh, Frederick on Frasier. I asked Sam for it in my letter. The worst. The worst. They are so cool. The worst part for me was when they did the who's on first moment about the bar name. Oh no. Oh no, shut down too. There's where. Where's where? Where's where was was, isn't it? Just this dumb back and forth that went on and on and on and it would never end. Okay. Not okay. That place is lame. You know, in the back of my mind, I'm hoping that eventually it'll be funny. Like it'll be like the South Park where Kurtman is getting probed. <laughs> and they just describe how like it starts funny. Okay, go ahead. I'm all out of farts now. <laughs> and then it loses its funny. It stopped being funny 40 seconds ago, boy. And then it's funny again. <laughs> okay, now it's funny again. And like they were right at each point they hit. But How I Met Your Mother, they were never funny with it tonight. That's not wrong. I don't want you to think like I hated this whole episode. And the title sequence was great. I love stuff like this. I feel like it breathes a new life into the show. Some people might see this as like a jumping the shark moment, and there's a risk of that. But I had the same sense of like rebirth and just joy when The Office did this a season or two ago. I was like, boom, all right, new show, here we go. The Office is gonna be new again. It was great to see the How I Met Your Mother cast do something fun like this. Here's what I love about How I Met Your Mother. They'll do like the um, sitcom device where it'll be like, you have to pretend to be somebody you're not. And, you, and the whole episode will be the hijinks of them trying to like fool Barney's dad, played by Trinity, AKA, Third Rock from the Sun, dude, John Lithgow. You expect the whole episode to be about them. Made some minor improvements to your identities. Keeping up these personas and Trinity being like, hmm, that, that's not what you said earlier. But it was it was really refreshing that like the only reason why they set those up was so that everyone else had their own subplots that they'd go on to. Like Ted and Robin and her secret crush and those dumb red boots. Like the red boots joke has never really been that funny. But the more I see it, the more I love it. It's like, you know what? Okay, all right, bring it. I'm with it now. So then Robin's secret crush is Anders from Battlestar. That'd be cool if they ended up. Although, Barney might be having feelings again. Maybe I've met her already. I don't know, I can go either way. Anders or Barney. I don't, you know what, after that beginning, it's hard to think I would give this episode anything above an eight, but I'm gonna give it an 8.5. Yeah, 8.5.